come back up north to a little rock pile I found. Let's see if we can catch some fish on a mamba jig. Oh, well, it's been a tough day, but at least we got us a good one. Oh, I'll jump one more time, big old guy. There we go. We finally caught one today. <laughs> Uh, it's been a tough day. I had a couple bites on the air frog this morning and they wouldn't hook up kind of like they were yesterday. Pulled up on a little point. I'd caught some previous years and picked up a mama jig with the knockout again just like last year. Third cast. Big old fish runs off with it. That was a good fish on the mama jig and the knockout again. Got my four inch Demiki knockout green pumpkin on there. Made about four or five casts on that rock pile. Caught a five pounder on this setup. I'm gonna show you what I was using to throw this. I've got it on 20 pound P-line fluorocarbon. Hands down, one of the best fluorocarbons out there. This is a 6'9 Demiki Dark Angel skipping rod. I actually got Demiki to design it for me. The reel is a Daiwa Tatula seven to three gear ratio. And you really want that fast gear ratio when you're hopping that jig like that because a lot of times those fish will knock slack in your line and you've got to catch up to them fast so you can reel down and get a good hook set in them. This setup's perfect for what I like to do with a jig. It allows me to skip it if I get around a dock. And also if I'm fishing out deeper, I've still got a long enough rod with enough power in it that I can set the hook on a long cast and get that hook in them. Mamba jig, four inch green pumpkin Tamiki knockout and the air frog, all available on Tackle Warehouse. Oh, wow. Yeah. 50 plus UV, so it's going to protect you. But the unique thing about this shirt, you can.